The Corn School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by BASF and Pride Seeds. There's a lot of momentum out there for fungicide use in corn, mostly because of the commodity prices and how great the crop looks, as well as the early planting. In our data over the last six years with fungicide application headline, we've seen out of 282 trials, an 8 to 10 yield bushel, an 8 to 10 bushel yield increase. So in our headline trials, not only are we seeing excellent disease control, but we're also seeing very good sustainability as well. Because when plant starts to mature, it takes all the energy and carbohydrates and sugars from the leaves and puts it into the cob. But if that disease is under, if that corn plant is under stress by disease or drought, it starts to take that nutrients and energy from the stock, which leads to a lot of lodging. So we see a lot of momentum with fungicide application, not only for the yield increase, but also the sustainability and the ease of harvest. So here we are in mid-July and the corn's at full tassel, which is the optimal timing for a fungicide application. Although we've been under some drought stress in this location, the corn still seems to look excellent, but we still are in need of a rain. The way to tell that the corn's the optimal timing for a fungicide application is once you see the tassels and if you see the brown silks, if you can light them on fire, then that means that your application window is over. So although we've been under a lot of moisture stress this year, the corn looks pretty good. It's not starting to fire up at the bottom, whereas if the corn was starting to fire up, especially to the cobs, a fungicide application wouldn't benefit you because the plant's already shut down. So you want to go after your highest yielding field, a field like this one where the corn looks excellent for the middle of July. We have a high yield potential. You want to get out there and protect that crop once the leaves have the top leaves have emerged because 75% of your yield comes from the cob up. So you want to protect these leaves, keep them free of disease in order to maximize your yield and take advantage of today's commodity prices.